It's February 15th, 2019. It's about 8.30 in the morning, and I'm going to start by reading the dreams from last night. So the first dream is someone... Uh, I think it might be Melinda, but it might not be Melinda. Now, my sense, by the way, Melinda was sort of in a dream from last night, and she's sort of in the background... Or, she was sort of in the background of the dream from the night before last, and she's sort of in the background of the dream from last night. So someone is involved in an endeavor with me, something to do with gold and money, all these issues about getting paid, trusting someone to pay at the end. It's connected to gold. Now, as I was waking up and writing this, the television set was on in the background. And I write, note, the So Clean CPAP cleaning commercial uses the phrase, I don't even have to push a button or anything. So when I was awake writing it down the stream, this commercial must have been on, and I must have connected this commercial with my dream that I had at least once, I think maybe more than once, with um, Cal Berkeley having an elevator that goes down and I don't even have to push a button or anything. So I don't know if it's deliberate that, that I don't have to push a button, the elevator just goes down. Is I don't know if it's a con coincidence that... It, I mean, it's probably not a coincidence that it's linked to the commercial. So I guess my real question is... What came first, the commercial or that dream about the elevator? That dream about the elevator I had, I think, in November. October. No, I remember exactly when it was. It was October 31st because it was, it was the same day that the girl was killed falling 10 stories in Dinky Town, the girl from Bayside. Um, I suspect that the dream came after the commercial. I don't know for sure. But um, it might have to do with just this word CPAP. C-P-A-P. Which probably stands for something, you know, four words. I think it's, you know, four. Anyway, uh, so it could be, you know, P being the word that's used for Chris and I. It might be C as in C. And then A is architect. So it might be, that might actually be linked to the CPAP commercial saying, C, the architect of the P. And P, I think the reason why P is connected to Chris and I, my best guess is that it's like a, looks like an inverted B, B being for blood or family. So um, it's basically saying that Cal Berkeley is an architect, maybe even a the primary architect of our situation. The other thing that button is connected to is um, like triggers, like, you know, if you are um, subject to trauma-based mind control, you might be triggered by things. So button, I think sometimes is slang for trigger. I also think button is sometimes slang for devices that are used for surveillance, like little hidden microphones and things like that. So um, I don't even have to push a button the elevator just goes down in the dream but here it's like a CPAP clean okay 